thank you, Father, for your love and this beautiful day that you have given us to celebrate our birthday boy, Darren. Woohoo! <laughs> we want Darren to feel welcome in the nest yes. and that he celebrated for his 27th birthday. What a better way than to celebrate the gift of his wonderful life. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Darren. Weightlifting and fishing. Ooh. Jack Snow. Jack Snow. Yeah, but then the big one was um, the biggest I caught was um, was a striper. And how big was that? A good thirty-two. Wow! Whoa. That's a big one. Thirty-two pounds. Oh, the big Whoa. one. Darren, I want to know, is your favorite Bible verse, follow me and I will make you fishers of men? <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> one day, maybe one of these days we'll go to fishing, at, um, you know, like a field trip. And you're going to teach us how. I like that. So you Sparrow's have fishing trip. Yeah, yeah, there we go. And sinkers. Uh-huh. Big sinkers. Big sinkers? Uh -huh. Yeah, like a... With a uh, cannonball and a torpedo and a pyramid sinker. Man, wow. you're the real you're the real deal. That's for sure. Hey, Darren, if we go fishing together, I don't like to touch the fish. Will you take them off the hook for me if I catch one? Uh, yeah. Okay, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Oh, yeah, but if it's a stingray, we've got to just cut the line and then. Just let it, because the salt water will dissolve the steel. So, oh, oh my gosh! Well, um, tell us a little bit about the weight lifting. I thought I heard lift weight, weight lifting. Yeah. Nationals. 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 Wow. Oh my gosh! <laughs> American Opens. And I started weightlifting when I was sixteen. He's like a gym rat, so we all enjoy going to the gym, and we make a lot of friends. Um, and I also like coffee. Oh, <laughs> oh right on. Yeah, my kind of and, people. Yeah, and I like to walk, especially during pandemic. We walk a lot more. Uh, I like collecting baseball cards. Uh huh. I live out in the country. I love taking walks. Love hang hanging out here. Um, I don't love friends, do. love coffee. Oh, pour it on me, man. Love <laughs> coffee, love reading books, love mm -hmm. doing that. Uh -huh. And I love just learning new things. And I love to encourage people and I love to be encouraged. There you go. Oh. Yes, I've written a book and I've got a second manuscript done and I'm working on a third. I like to like watch things on YouTube I'm interested in and experiment with stuff sometimes. Mm -hmm. I heard that you like food. What is your favorite food? Uh, mainly chicken wings. Preston, what is your hobby? Ping my mom's tennis ball. Gun. So maybe he wants to pick up the skill again. And who knows? Yes, maybe one of these days we will try something new. How about that, Preston? Yes. Okay. Yes. Like I love, love spending time with my friends and family. That's what I miss the most is spending a lot of time with my family and um, my friends and to the pool and um, not necessarily swimming but just being in the water um, and spending time with the kids and and that's that's what is more rewarding to me is just the joy of other people sometimes i want to say that i enjoy attending the sparrow bible platform it's good for me and i'm so thankful to have friends I like to sing. I like to dance. Yeah, for Noah, his, I think his biggest hobby is reading. He really likes uh, Dr. Seuss books, like Marvin Kate. 
and like he's wearing right now his ABC t-shirt. Oh, cool. <laughs> yeah, I think his biggest hobby is probably Dr. Seuss. Yes. And then for me, same thing, my biggest hobby is probably um, playing and watching sports. And like, same thing with Noah, I like to express <laughs> myself by wearing my hobbies on my clothing. Cool. Uh, biggest, uh, my biggest uh, team is 49ers and Noah's biggest team is Dr. Seuss. So we have our hobbies. <laughs> You guys are so dumb. <laughs> I like that. Thank you. Thank you, Noah. Thank you, Daniels. He typed. Okay. That's right there. Basketball and walking, eating good food. He loves basketball, playing and watching it. And also walking. We used to hike a lot before COVID. Um, mm -hmm. And he really loves the outdoors. Um, and you said good food. He loves to eat. I think your favorite is chicken with rice. He loves chicken and rice bowls <laughs> and hamburgers. Right, Dan? <laughs> <laughs> and I, I love the outdoors too. I love being out in nature. I love the beach. Um, I love swimming. It's like so therapeutic. And I love um, ballroom dancing. I used to ballroom dance way back. <laughs> I love music. We both love music. And I love coffee. I love dogs. And I remember the dogs' names in the neighborhood, but not the people's names. Now, now his favorite things to do? Mm -hmm. I like go. Walking. Do you hear it? No. And listening to music. Right? Okay. So Noya likes to go out for walking and we often visit Shoreline Park and the Rancho San Antonio as well. And uh -huh. also he likes Bayland Park uh -huh. in Sunnyvale. Uh-huh. He listened to music from YouTube and I don't know why he was he's listening, but he's flipping in you know, all kinds of music. And of course he likes to eat and he likes Thai food. Uh -huh. yeah. And of course, you know, he likes to play catch. And he used to take swimming lessons, horseback riding mm -hmm. lessons and horseback vaulting lessons. Mm -hmm. He loves all those and also cooking classes. Mm -hmm. But those are all before a pandemic and years ago before the pandemic. And for me, I I also I'm I'm a coffee lover too. All day long, I drink coffee. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and my I do many things, you know, reading, crocheting, bread make, baking. But my favorite thing is to hang out with Noah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I am from Wisconsin. So far away from home. So we don't have earthquakes there. We have tornadoes. So some of you might be afraid of tornadoes, but you know, you can hide from a tornado. You cannot hide from an earthquake. <laughs> so that was something that really freaked me out when I moved here. But <laughs> so uh, I have something in common with Max because I actually am a scientist. I'm a retired scientist, particularly I'm a chemist and a microbiologist. Oh. And uh, that love for that, being a chemist, has brought me into a hobby I have of gardening. And uh, because we have crazy squirrels and other animals in our yard, mm -hmm. I also started to teach myself, thanks to YouTube, how to do some hydroponic gardening in my house. And um, more interestingly, I started to learn how to do uh, regrowing some uh, things like, for example, um, bok choy. So, you know, you cut that bottom of the bok choy and you throw it out, you can actually put it in water and root it. And so I brought a, a couple of um, items that are hydroponically grown. I don't know if you can see the roots in the bottom. Yes, we can see that. Wow. This is, uh, this is actually a bok choy that I'm regrowing from just a uh, just something that I cut that I used and I'm growing a new bok choy from. 
And here is an, another one that I'm growing. And this, can anybody figure out what this might be? Cilantro or celery? Celery? It's, it's celery. Uh, so the one thing that is different about me mm -hmm. that I'm going to say from you guys, which you're going to find like really weird, especially Nick, is I don't know. I've tried so hard to teach myself to like coffee. I don't know how something can smell so good and taste so bad. <laughs> Abby, what is your hobby? What do you like? I like hobby. Mm -hmm, you like hobby. What do you like to do? Trampoline. Trampoline. You like trampoline. You like to yeah. jump? Good. Um, what other hobbies do you have? Do you like swimming? I saw that you have a swimming pool. What do you like to do? A swimming pool. Swimming pool, you like to I swim? love water. You love, love water. water. It's so funny because I have so much in common with Janice. <laughs> <It's scary. laughs> so, well, so, so I recently started trying to propagate my rhododendron. So I just snipped it and stick it in water. Yeah. Hoping that roots will grow. It's been about a couple of weeks, nothing yet. So, so it's just, you know, a branch and sitting in water. <laughs> so that's kind of a little bit like what you're doing. And yeah. then for, for my birthday, I don't know what this is. I guess it's called an indoor garden. You can grow your own herb. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. So so it, it took, I got it in February and you you have these little pot things and you put seeds in it and then it just floats in water and yeah. it circulates the water and it gives a light. So I don't know, nothing's growing yet. And that's been a couple of weeks. So I'm kind of doing my own indoor thing, <laughs> except I'm not like you, Janice. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm just reading the instructions and, and, and I don't know, reading instructions and, 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 and watching YouTube videos a little bit. Yeah, that's right. Well, I keep my fingers crossed and, and see how that goes. <laughs> that's yeah. so funny. And then the other thing we have in common is I don't like coffee either. <laughs> <laughs> Nick, I, you have to I, break uh, for when did you? <laughs> I like the you know, smell. Well, like you said, I like this, the smell, but I don't think I'm not a coffee, coffee drinker and never have been. <laughs> yeah, so other hobbies I have is I like to bake. I like to bake cookies. I like to actually decorate cookies. Sure. I enjoy doing that. Um, and I also like to sing and I like worship music. Um, so, so I, and that's how, I, yeah, I really enjoy worship music. I love singing worship music. So that's kind of the two things that, that stands out and, and I enjoy spending my time on. I want to say that I have a coffee mug here. <laughs> However, I um, I don't know anything about coffee. All I know is I need it when I'm sleepy and it will help me. And I drink instant coffee. I don't drink it from like brewing or, you know, the real stuff. I don't add sugar. I add, I add coconut milk or I add oat milk. <laughs> I am very different opposite to Janice. <laughs> <laughs> oh, totally opposite from Janice because my brain is not a scientific brain at all. I'm not, I don't understand anything about science. I mean, it's totally like, what is, what are you guys talking? And I remember when I was little, when I take chemistry classes, the chemistry classes was like a torture. I think art and craft. So I enjoy music a lot. And, and I didn't learn painting until I turned 50. I said that, oh, I need to take painting classes. I really want to pursue my interests. I mean, in 50, I believe that it's not too old to learn something new. We still have a lot of time. One of my dreams when I was little was to learn ballet. And I still have one more dream that I want to pursue. And that is I want to learn how harpsichord, how to play harp. So I don't, know, I don't know how, but I just found the harp is very beautiful. Let's bow our heads, cut our wings together. Let's pray. Mm -hmm. Our Heavenly Father, we thank you for celebrating Darren's birthday, Lord, and being able to be together and learn so much more about each other, Lord. We have so much in common, and yet we're also so different, Lord. And we thank you for making us unique and different in our own ways. We thank you, God, for, for Darren. We pray that you will bless this whole year. We're so thankful that he is able to join us every week now. And we just want to grow our friendship with each other, Lord. Lord, we ask that you be with us this week um, for all the concerns that we have that are not spoken. We lift them up to you. We ask for 
your guidance and your peace. In Jesus' name we pray, amen.